Hollyoaks star Anna Passy heartbroken by major show change as she confirms it's the end of an era. The set in question was built last year to facilitate the arrival of Rafe Harcourt and sister who later turned out to be his wife Dilly, with the real-life Arlie Hall acting as the exterior. Sienna Blake, played by Anna, would spend many an evening there in a bid to try and woo Rafe after she and soulmate Ethan Williams decided to con him out of his millions. Following Rafe's demise and the discovery that Dilly was, in fact, her biological sister Sienna moved into the manor permanently, but with the deceased Earl in debt at the time of his death, the house was repossessed. This, unfortunately, means that we'll be saying goodbye to Harcourt Grove, with upcoming scenes seeing Sienna, Dilly and Liberty Savage move out of the mansion and back to the flat at Oakdale Drive. The Harcourt set was truly a sight to behold. Trust me. I saw it in person and it was one of the most incredible things I've ever seen, so I'll be devastated to see it go and I'm not the only one, with Anna equally upset. But while one era comes to an end another begins, with Sienna's long-lost grandmother Martha rocking up. Martha proves to be a proper Blake, claiming to be one thing while she's secretly up to something else. Sienna sees that Dilly and Liberty are being very naive, accepting Martha into the fold, but Sienna has her eye on her and knows there is more to it and doesn't trust her. When she finds out it was her that took her blood, she obviously knows there's something deeper coming from it. Anna was quick to heap praise on actress Sherry Hewson, branding her perfect in her role as the Blake matriarch. She's fabulous to work with and I think she fits into the weird, dysfunctional family so perfectly, she infused. Martha, however, isn't the only new addition to the Blake family, with Sienna's uncle Jez set to take the village by storm. Jez, being Patrick's twin brother, will be played Jeremy Sheffield, who is returning to the show yet again. Jeremy, whose dastardly character Patrick was killed off eight years ago, made a brief return as the villainous headmaster earlier this year, portraying a figment of Dilly's imagination. This time, however, the actor is back in a more regular capacity and according to Anna Jez is completely different in comparison to his previous alter ego. Sienna finds that quite hard to deal with at first, because she and Maxine have a lot of terrible history with Patrick. He's so nice, but being in the body and the head of Patrick is difficult for them to get their head around. Anna promised so much great stuff to come for Hollyoaks, confirming that she was moved to tears by some of the developments in the scripts she's read thus far. People who watched the show when Patrick Blake was around are going to really, really enjoy it, she said. I think they're going to see a big dive into the history files of the Blake storylines. Be prepared it's all very exciting, whatever the future holds for Sienna, let's just hope the Ethan is involved, with fans very keen to see the two back together. Hollyoaks is about to herald in a new era in September, with episodes being reduced from 5 to 3. To facilitate the change, there have been major cast cuts, with reports claiming that 20 stars will be exiting in the changeover. Said Anna on the subject. I find it quite difficult. But I do think it's time for change and you can resist it, or you can embrace it. I think what Hollyoaks is doing so brilliantly is fully embracing it, and it's a different era. When I used to be a little kid, my grandma used to watch Coronation Street religiously and we'd be sent out of the room. It doesn't really work that way anymore for a lot of people and I do think if the audiences are watching it online, that's where we need to be. Bạn dù là theo dõi một sản phẩm của Israel Soul Soul. Xin chào và hẹn gặp lại các bạn ở những video sau.